guys. Let's see. Yeah, I'm in there. All right. So, I think this video might be a bit of a pity party for me, okay? Because I'm just... Uh, I'm in flux in between being really annoyed with being blind and feeling empowered by this. Like, I really feel like I've lost more vision again over the last, like, few days, you know? And uh, whenever this happens, it's just like, okay, yep, I'm going blind. This is just what happens. Like, and I'm fucking struggling. Um, it's really hard to maintain hope and faith and belief in myself and my capacity to meet the needs of my growing business and self um, as my vision keeps deteriorating and I keep feeling like I'm losing more and more of my capabilities to do things on my own and it's like I feel like I make a few steps forward and like learning how to do this blind thing and then I lose more vision and I feel like I'm lost again. I don't think I've cried about going blind in a while. If I'm just really feeling it right now, I've been dealing with a lot of emotions and feelings over the last four or five days, just feeling really sensitive. This moon cycle, I'm on my moon, and right at the end, and um, the last two days, I just, I've been having a hard time doing the things I need to do for my business, like, you know, there's things I have to do, you know, for life and for business, and fucking struggling it's really hard to get these things done on my own as a blind person now I can't can't see I can't I'm fucking struggling <sighs> and I'm really trying not to feel disempowered and give up but it's I'm really in a conundrum and facing a personal challenge right now so I really needed to make a video and talk about it because it's it's getting to me. I'm um, catching myself, pulling back, and just not figuring out how to move forward and having self-condemning thoughts around the blindness and feeling defeated, and I don't want to be defeated by this blindness, and um it's a lot, though a lot trying to figure out how to be who I am and <laughs> and answer phone calls or not answer phone calls or answer texts or not answer texts I can't see texts I'm missing things all the time I'm constantly losing things trying to find things Walking into things, uh, typos galore. <sighs> yeah, just a imperfect human being, perfectly imperfect, right? <laughs> uh, just trying to find my peace and my imperfections and who I am right now in this world, and it's fucking hard being who I am and feeling really challenged by the all of which my life is right now <laughs> and um struggling fighting you know but um doing the best I can I just had a really 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 intense yoga practice on the roof with the sun and it felt really good um just trying to move through this stuff and not let it get me down and take me to the place it did a while ago you know I don't know some of you have been newly following me some of you have been following me for a while you know this going blind thing you know took me to some really dark places not too long ago and I 
put myself in a hospital because I couldn't figure out what to do. It was just too dark inside. Everything's going dark around me and it's then the insides get dark, you know, and so now I'm like facing darkness on so many levels and I'm doing a lot better and seeing the light and the darkness. Um, but it's still a struggle. I'm still like, I still have some dark thoughts and um, can't deny it. Not going to hide it. Needs to talk about it. It's real. And um, it doesn't make me any less of an amazing person, healer, or teacher. You know, I'm human. as Just as much as I am everything else I identify. I am a... I'm Candace. And I have my life experiences. And... Um, Yep, that's that. <laughs> All right, I'm feeling pretty vulnerable, but also seen and heard, and like I got to whew, release some stuff that was just like ah inside me. These videos are really good for me with that. And um, if you don't know, check out I created a group for us to experience this. It's called Conscious Dumping Circle. Look on Facebook for the Conscious Dumping Circle because I notice there's a lot of people that use Facebook and um, social media as an outlet for like spewing their shit or public journaling. And I've just decided to just do it as, a, you know, call it what it is. So, um, but I created this group for us to consciously dump. Check it out. <laughs> I love you guys. Have a wonderful day. And I look forward to seeing you all tomorrow for our tantric Thai sacral yoga sage play shop where I'm going to teach you some awesome stuff and you'll get to play with it. Excuse me. You can just witness, learn, and observe. You do have to be here by um, closed doors time, but you can leave whenever you want. Um, you have to get your tickets in advance. Make sure you look at the ticket instructions and check out the bonus ticket with the awesome package of Thai massage, uh, tantric Thai massage offerings. That's 50 to 70% off my regular price. Um, and, um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> Love you guys. Bye-bye.